Hey everyone, welcome back to Eat Sleep Reef. So we're here at 2017 Reef of Palooza. I attempted to do a live stream for you guys that uh, did get to follow and check it out. I tried my best to do a live stream, but the internet here just wasn't having it. Um, we're gonna be taking you guys around kind of uh, everything here. You know, I saw I remember when, when I missed out at the Reef of Palooza events, uh, the, the New York and Orlando one, I, I kind of was hoping for, you know, someone would have done a full coverage, full walkthrough as if I was there. Uh, didn't, uh, didn't see that. There was a lot of great videos on there, um, but I don't know, maybe my, my style of watching videos, I want to see the whole layout as if I was there. Um, so what we're going to be doing, we're going to be taking you guys all the way through the whole um, the whole event so you guys are going to be able to experience it as if you guys were here um, and in person and not just me showing you what I think is cool um, I'll kind of just show you guys all around and then once I'm done with that I'll probably continue gathering some some videos of what I think is cool and then you know I'll just cut and in, uh, cut them in and out but let's get started so we're here at the entrance I'm gonna be changing the camera up here real quick all right, so this is the entrance here, guys. This is kind of how it all starts. I have a filter here, so I do need the filter. I'll throw it over um, the lens so you guys can see the corals and the blues. Um, you can see as soon as you enter, you got coral view. You got, I'm not sure what company this is. Um, you got coral view over here on the right. And of course, coral view with their ice cap. They have their uh, 3K here. And I believe this is new. I have, I have not seen uh, the 2K. I had not seen the 2K. So the 2K, you can see all they really did is take off one half and plug it up on one end um, and kind of just made it, you know, half of what the 3K uh, would be. Because there's a lot of people that want to run them in smaller tanks, but just not the space uh, to do it. But you can see here, they got tons of stuff here. RODIs, uh, skimmer. I believe there's a skimmer here. Uh, another skimmer. We've got some lights. We got some filters, so just ton, tons of great stuff we got here at the Coral View booth. So the next booth we have here is a sandbar. I'm gonna put the filter over here. Look at that, no filter, filter. So let me make sure everything's right. So we got everything here, a lot of nice corals. You guys can check out, a lot of good color. Uh, most importantly, just great pricing. So I'm gonna quickly take you guys by here. I'm not gonna sit too long. But you guys can see there. And then making our way down, we got uh, Marine uh, Fish Love. Let me take the filter off of you guys here. We got uh, Diablo Corals here. Let me put the filter so you guys can check out a little bit more of the nice colors under the blues. A lot of nice stuff. Looks like they sold most of their stuff yesterday. Just check. That's beautiful right there. That's really, really nice. And then we'll continue making our way here through the outside. We got eShops. eShops is here. They have a beautiful tank right here. Look who we have here. No, I tried doing live and then uh, the internet sucked. So I'm just gonna do a regular video. So we got Miss Karen here checking out the tanks. But yeah, this one really caught my eye. It's really simple, but yet really, really beautiful. Now I'm not sure what light, I think it's their own light they're running. But looks very, very nice. Nice sump on the bottom, love it. So we're gonna continue taking a look past eShops. Nice stuff, huh? A lot of nice stuff. We got another tank here. And then we have ATI. I don't need a filter over ATI. We got ATI over here. And we got the very famous from BRS TV. We have Ryan. Mr. Ryan here. Let's zoom up on him here a little bit. Oh, wait. oh no, you can't really zoom. Huh. I guess it doesn't let you zoom when you're uh, recording. So here I, I'll take off the filter. You guys can check out.
and then coming around, we got advanced advanced uh, acrylics. We got JBJ here as well with their tank. They got their 28. Uh, the 28. Oh wow! I think this is brand new. I had never seen this. 28 gallon Wi-Fi with JBJ. 28 gallon Wi-Fi. New the flat panel series. This is a 45 gallon tank. That's our new 65 gallon. And then we have the 25 gallon on the other wow, side. Wow! This so is this yeah. Is I was. Flat panel I was really wondering what you guys were going to be doing as far as bigger tanks, because you know I personally have the right. 45. Um, and I have the QB as well, the 15 gallon, but I mean, this is 60 gallon, correct? This is a 65. And again, with the same concept of JBJ being all in one, all everything one included. Dual returns on the side here. <clears throat> so you can see the two pumps. Okay, okay. All filtration in the back. It's beautiful. I mean, is this the first time? This is the first time I see this one. Yes, this is the first time we've released it in California. In California, we okay. We have had it at a couple of the other trade shows over okay. at Super Zoo and uh, Global Pet. All right. Uh, Macna. So. so you guys get to see here at first hand JBJ releasing the new 60 gallon tank. Uh, you guys know I'm a happy owner of the 45 gallon rimless and absolutely love it. So they used to be the curved fronts and now we've got all the flat panels. All, all the, the flat around. panels, yeah. yeah. I did see that. No more of the curve, just straight flat panels. So yeah, Correct. absolutely love it. And then we have our Wi-Fi 28 gallon nano cube over here. Okay. <clears throat> this is a new Wi-Fi unit. So you guys can see it's here the... 45, it's a 40 watt three channel red white and blue fully controllable okay uh, wi-fi unit and we have our own jbj app now which we're using oh i didn't even look at that so here you guys can see the app to control uh, the leds on their new 28 gallon oh, really stepping so up as you guys can see, here, you can see we'll end up with check blues. that out guys Check that out, fresh guys. Water with red and white lights. So yeah, being a very popular tank, I, I I think that was a really good move on you guys because every you know everybody has or has had a 28 gallon from JBJ. Correct. You guys can check and here now the app. You've got 10 preset settings type of thing that you can make for your day to night light settings. Okay. Uh, for all the guys that really enjoy the charting, you can take a look at the chart on the app here, and you get to keep track of what you're doing with your lighting. Okay, so not just throwing out a number in a valley right. and saying, I hope it works. And now if you go to the preview, you'll get to see that we've done kind of a quick preview to see what your day to night settings for the 10 are. Okay, so right now, now it's running through the whole schedule. Through the schedule of I the see. Settings. Wow, you guys get to see, we got to see some pretty cool stuff here at the JBJ booth. As you guys know, I'm a very happy owner of their tank. Absolutely love it with the 45 and the 15. Really happy to see them with the new Wi-Fi and as well the 60 gallon. So be sure to check them out, guys. So here, ma making our way down, you guys saw we got to see something new from JBJ. They're introducing a lot. No more curved glass, flat panel now. So really happy to see that. You can see, for you guys that wanted to check out some corals, we got tons of corals here at the event. Oh yeah, I know. Great prices. Oh, that's JB, no. See some starfish. Oh, they got a, a lot of cool stuff here. Uh, smart digital water testing. Wait, I've seen this. So turning here to the right, we have Zet Light. For you guys that follow Inappropriate Reefer, you've probably seen him uh, talking about these lights. He looks like he's been having great success with them. Um, I've been following his channel, obviously checking them out. So we're here at their booth today checking out their product. They got some nice brochures. Um, I believe this is a camera. Looks like a camera to me. So that's, wow, that's really cool. Oh shoot. How much is, how much is something uh, like this? A hundred? A hundred? It's not bad at all. So you guys, okay. See the, the new small light, also inappropriate reefer. I believe they sent him two of the bigger lights and he received one of these, I think for his 15 gallon tank. Um, I can see a doser as well. They got a three channel doser here. Looks actually really, really nice. I like the design of it. Um, let's check out the LED uh, lighting a little bit more. You can see it's a very clean, very sleek uh, design of it. It doesn't draw too much attention on the tank. And then on the left here, you can see it has kind of like the spotlights. Uh, you can really focus in on you know a certain coral or whatever. 
and it looks like they're sold individually. So they're supplemental. If you feel your tank needs a little bit more light in one area, you can easily buy these to supplement it. Um, and I really, really think they, they, you know, you can add kind of like a spotlight effect to a specific coral. So making our way down, we have, of course, um, Apex. Apex is here, um, you know, showing off their stuff. I mean, just check this out, guys. They're all big on automation. You can see it here, monitor it in live time, fully automated. They really caught my, my attention with their new um, auto testing uh, kit, auto testing, whatever you'd like to call it. Actually, I wanna show you guys this over here too. They have a really nice big peninsula tank and one thing that catches my attention, they really got you know, the top, top LEDs on it. They have the AI52. Okay, they got here the, the max spec it looks like, and then followed by the Radeon. So it's really nice to see all three of those lights on a tank setup. It looks absolutely beautiful as you guys can see. We got tons, tons of, of stuff, but like I said, I'm, I'm really interested in their tester they have. Just check that out, guys. It's the Trident. So that's it right here. It's very nice. I think a lot of us are going to be. I know. It's not, I think a lot of us are going to be looking forward to that because it just makes testing so much easier and really monitoring your tank and keeping it exactly where you want to keep it. So, let me take off the filter here because we're getting a glare, there we go. So making our way around here, we got VCA. I'm actually not familiar who they are. So we're here with uh, Moto Aquariums. You can check out uh, their tanks. Moto Aquariums, they're, I don't know how new they are, but as far as their name getting out. I'm starting to you know, hear about them a little bit more. You can see they have really, really nice, uh, nice tank. They got small stuff, they got 45 gallon. And then they have here the, uh, the 70 gallon. It's actually, this thing's really, really nice. Yeah, the stand is, I'm a big fan of, of, of white. So I guess this one doesn't open. So it doesn't want to open for me, but oh shoot! I'm so sorry, I tried to miss the camera. That's a camera. What was that? The camera. You hook up to the phone. Which one? The camera, right? It's no, this is a filter. Oh. Just for the blues. Let me see. What's different? Let me see. The blues. Oh wow. Yeah. Oh okay. Yeah, that's it. So maybe. So do, can you like uh, zoom in, zoom out more, or what? Yeah, yeah. You can. Do, well, no. This is just a filter. Oh, just a filter. Just a filter, so so you don't see the blue. Hmm. Yeah. Why you don't want the blue? Because it looks really bad. Oh. Yeah. <laughs> so we have here their uh, 70 gallon full setup here. You guys can check it out. Beautiful, beautiful stand. Um, e L Coral, I believe. We got Alternate uh, Reef LLC up here. We got Aquatic Fantasy. So right now I don't have the filter on you guys, so you, that's why you're probably seeing the, the blues a little bit bad. We got Red Sea here on the right. Of course, you know, kind of speaks for themselves. I don't think they need much talking about. And then coming down this way, we have uh, Kona, and then what is it? Legendary Coral. Oh wow, three for 20 bucks. I think I'm gonna be back. If you guys want to see some coral, check that out, guys. Just a great selection of coral here. Absolutely great selection. Uh, Reef Grow is here. DC Coral here on my right. And it looks like we also have Instant Ocean on the left. Marine Lens. Oh, that, those are beautiful. Check that out, guys. Oh, I forget the name of those. I forget the name, but yeah, I've seen those before. So as you guys can see, I'm 
kind of going around looking at stuff as well as I'm um, showing you guys a video. So VW Reefs we have here on the left. We got Dr. Tim's on the right. We got Dr. Tim's, uh, Carib Sea. So this is kind of the whole middle aisle. Right now we made our way around the whole place and then we came around this way and we're coming up here, kind of to go down the middle and then we'll end it by coming around. So Aquatic Life is here. Oh, it looks like they're, oh, you can mount like any type of light on this thing. Check that out, guys. Oh, and T5, wow. You can put T5, sub, let me put the filter on so you guys can see. So you can mount, looks like various different lights. Um, there's the, I, the AI26, the Kessel, and as well the Prime. And as well, you can see this it's supplemented with the T5 here on the bottom. You can see the bulb there. So making our way around, we got, of course, uh, we got your reef here. Put on the filter, you guys can check out some coral. Let's check that out. We got a lot of nice stuff here. Tons, tons, tons of stuff. I mean, I could just go crazy. And then right behind us, we have, of course, Fritz. So Fritz always has a big presence here at the shows. Um, they don't mess around. You can see here, their beautiful stack of boxes. I mean, they, they just never mess around. They always come out, you know, ready to go. And then in here, we have Worldwide Coral. Again, you can never miss Worldwide Coral. They're almost at every event, at least I'm aware of. So let's check out what they brought today. A lot of great selection stuff. And like I said, really good pricing. Got any of your super trippy chalices? And then uh, two guys corals here behind us. You can see a lot of just so much stuff today. Um, we got Marine Depot here on the left. So Marine Depot bringing out obviously a wide selection of stuff. They got so much stuff. There's no way you could bring everything. And of course, we have Robert hiding away there in the back. We'll probably chat with him a little bit later. We got Brightwell Aquatics. We got Kessel. Kessel's here as well. Let me put the filter over them. There we go. We got Age of Aquariums here on the left. You can see a lot of these places, they don't have as much stuff on Sunday anymore. Most of the stuff was sold on Saturday. Uh, but still, some nice stuff here to, to look at. And kind of uh, the reasons I come on Sunday. One, there's less people. Um, got Jake Adams here chatting. And then uh, what else? Oh, again, but the reasons I come on Sunday is typically a little bit better pricing sometimes. Got Cobalt. Coral Collectors here. Let me put the uh, filter over. You guys can see a lot of nice stuff. Really nice. Nice, nice pieces. I mean, check that out, guys. Hi, how are you? Please, how are you? Very good. Wow, look at this. A little bit busy. Busy? Beautiful pieces. Just beautiful. Okay. How much is this Octo? Uh, about 180. 80? The beautiful coloration, as you guys can see. I know, I'm not sure what it, this is. Oh, Hermit? Oh, like cleanup crew, I guess. So right here we got Rod's Food, as you guys can see. I'm a big believer of Rod's Food. I use it in my tank. Uh, for you guys that follow me on Instagram, really love your food, man. I mean, it feeds the corals, feeds the fish. What else would you want, right? You got it, man. One-stop shop. Every, one -stop shop. So if you guys want to try um, great food out on the market, you know, I've tried a few of them. And I think I've seen really great results with uh, Rod's food. Great recipe. Fish love it. Coral love it. What else can I say? Ultra Gem. We got them here. Let's check this out, guys. Really nice selection here. Starfish. 
really, really nice stuff. What's happening, boss? How are you? And who else do we have here? I don't see a name here, so I'm not sure who they are. We got Macna, Ocean Nutrition on the left. I, I, I still use some of their stuff. Uh, Seaside, Seaside Aquatics, bringing down tons of stuff from their shop. And then this is kind of the place that really drew my attention and what I saw. Let me get the filter on, you guys. Asian Nutty Saltwater Connection. So, I mean, just check out this, guys. The, the rock dam's here for 35 bucks. And they're just absolutely beautiful. Absolutely beautiful. Let's take a look at some of the soft uh, corals they have over here, more on the left. Or zoas is what they are. Zoas, oh, they look like soft, uh, like torches and stuff, but I guess they're all zoas from far away. So. So let me show you guys a little bit more of what they got. Tons of LPS, pretty good pricing. Any of those, 55 bucks. Scully's here, look at the plates, 45 bucks and up. I really, really, really love that piece. What did I do? So let's make our way around. This is Lifeguard um, Aquatics. We're almost done, guys. We're kind of here on the final stretch. Um, AI, AI illumination is there. Um, we didn't stop by there, but AI is there. Um, all of these things I do want to show you. The Lifeguard Aquatics, for you guys that haven't seen them, Marine Depot kind of announced they were carrying them. And until you see them in person, you really see kind of what you're missing out. They're absolutely beautiful setups. They're not too big. Um, you know, you can put them pretty much anywhere in your house, kitchen, office, um, and they're absolutely beautiful. They kind of have a sweep back on the uh, front display, so it makes them very, very nice. You know, I really like how you can see it from every angle and really like the sweet back on the front of it. So, let me take the filter off so you guys can see the rest of the stuff they have. Uh, they got some lights, they got some flexible water returns, they got uh, scratch removal kits. I mean, they got tons of stuff, you know. Whatever you need, they kind of got you covered. They got a good selection of stuff here. Uh, but like I said, what really, really draws my attention is here, their uh, new tank. If you guys haven't checked them out, you can probably check them out on uh, Marine Depot. I'm sure there's a, a few other vendors that may have their stuff. And of course, you can check them out directly, uh, lifeguardaquatics.com. So a little bit more, we got uh, current. Uh, we'll, we'll make our way down this way, and then we'll kind of wrap around Marine Depot to go back the other way and go on the final stretch. We got current here. Let me put the filter uh, it kind of doesn't need a filter we got AI of course brilliantly simple this is kind of the new I don't know if you guys have been seeing Marine Depot uh, really talking about these new uh, filter cups I kind of not sure how they work yet but I see everybody posting about them um, they're really cool but yeah I'm gonna have to figure out later how they work and uh, you know kind of show you guys what they're all about so we already saw this side. We already went around, or we're gonna go around um, Marine Depot here. So let's wrap around it. And then we're gonna be on our final stretch after this, uh, this wrap around. I already lost my wife, but she's somewhere back there. We got killer coral here with a lot, a lot of nice stuff they brought down. You guys can check them out. So for you guys wonder where I get a lot of my corals, a lot of them do come from killer coral. And you can see here the reason why. They're just absolutely beautiful pieces and the pricing is really, really good. Um, see, 15, 16 dollars, 60 on up. I mean, just look at these pieces, just beautiful. The soft coral, I mean, just, I really love it. This is actually where I bought uh, my gold Aussie torch. Um, are you guys wondering? So Killer Coral, he's local to me, so I didn't order it online, but um, he is local to me. So here we have Matt Corals, another place where I get a few of my corals from for you guys that 
uh, do follow me on Instagram. You guys can see Mac himself and brought out some nice pieces. Let's check it out, guys. Really, really nice pieces. You, you might you might see a few coral in here that, that are in my tank. Um, and that's because I said, because I, I buy a lot of my stuff from Mac. So making our way down, we have eye-catching coral. And wow, it, do, it does catch my eye. I really love the display. Check out the display, guys. Really, really nice display. Really interesting, a different way to display um, display your corals. And then we have a Reefer's Cove here as well. Oh, wow. I may need to buy some. <laughs> Check it out. A lot of nice, nice stuff. But like I said, a lot of stuff was cleaned up from uh, from Saturday. So here we just came from the back here. So now we're kind of on the final stretch here. Law office aquariums. Um, wow, check that out. Very nice stuff. Very nice stuff. And then we have all delight corals right here. And then, of course, you cannot forget uh, zoanthids.com. You guys can probably guess what they got. Just check that out, guys. I've been looking for some trumpet corals, and they got them. So a lot of nice pieces. Oh, God, look at this, guys. It's a beautiful selection. And that's uh, zoanthids.com. You guys can check them out. Uh, behind me, we have uh, California Aquariums. I, I haven't even been down this place, actually. So we have California Aquariums. Let's check that out, guys. Really, really nice, nice, nice pieces. I mean, you know, sometimes we all wish there was LFSs that, that around us that had, you know, this much selection. We have... Cali lid corals here. I have crazy corals right here. Wow, that's a good deal on the Radions. Check that out, guys. Six fifty for the Radion Pro G4. I'm guessing they just got them for the show, and then they just want to get rid of them after. So wow. So let's make our way down this way. Where uh, Jason, oh, Jason Fox, of course. Jason Fox, guys. I thought you wanted to go to Marine Depot. Hold on, not yet. Jason Fox Signature Corals. Um, you guys, you know, they've been in the reefing community. You probably know all about Jason Fox. A lot of nice stuff. Uh, what do we have? Uh, unique, unique Corals is here as well. We'll visit them here on our way uh, back this way. So we got Fluval, Dynasty Coral. Man, I mean, just check this out, guys. I don't even know where to go. This Bam Coral right here. So we came from that middle uh, middle part, so we're gonna come around here. And look, look who we have here, guys. Jake himself going through people's stuff. Through my stuff. Oh, through your stuff. Going through his stuff. Oh God! What is that? Like a blastamusa. It's like red with black polyps. Check that out, guys. Super cool. Yeah, I gotta see Check some that out. They got some nice pieces, huh? Uh, I got too much. Too much, dude. I've been looking at stuff, and I'm like, man, looking at too much stuff. But check this out, guys. This this tank here. I'm not sure what the tank is, but you can see. I mean, some of the stuff I can't even name. I have no idea what that's called, but it's beautiful. Uh, mainly saw uh, some SPS here you can see on the top. What is that? Periscalemia vitiensis oh from Solomon Islands, which is now God. closed for export. So it was like one of the last ones to get out. Yeah. Wow, look at that. My Excuse God. Me, me, sir. That's beautiful. <laughs> so making our way around you can see they got oh wow they have one for sale man I, so everything here is lit up with the uh, radions you guys can see
coming around. What else do we have? Oh, they got another, more selection here. Of, it looks like S SPS and some soft. We got OCC with some sharks here. Oh, you're good, you're good. I'm good, thank you. You can pet a shark if you'd like. Uh, oh, we've already been through this area. Red Sea. Yeah, we've already been through this area. So I think that's pretty much it. We'll probably, let, let's see where we're going to end it. We'll probably end it somewhere over here. Ah, where is it? We'll end it kind of where we started here in the front. So this show is kind of coming to an end, guys. I really hope you guys enjoyed uh, this video, kind of the, the, the layout I did. I hope you guys liked it because that's kind of what I was looking for. You know, whenever I miss an event, I want to feel as if I was there, not just seeing the video as, you know, what someone thinks is cool. Um, I kind of just go through it. And then after I'm done, I'm going to get some more B-roll shots of what I think is cool and kind of include in there some interviews. But I um, really hope you guys enjoyed uh, this video. I should have this done pretty quick, not much editing to this. Um, so we should have it up very quick. Uh, maybe even today, tomorrow, uh, we'll see. But um, as always guys, thanks for watching. Be sure to check me out on Instagram. I'll have the link in the description below. And um, what else, I'm trying to see what else I'm missing. I think that's pretty much it. For you guys that did watch this video, all the way to the end be sure to leave me a comment down below letting me know that you actually watched the video all the way to an end and um if you are if you are subscribed to my channel great if you're not and i earned your subscription be sure to subscribe and if you are subscribed be sure to hit the bell so you can get notified anytime uh, there is a new video up so as always guys thanks for watching happy reefing